guys how's everybody doing today i hope that everybody's doing great welcome back to my channel hello my name is carla and today i'm going to share with you a haul <laughs> i love hauls and i do a lot of hauls in my channel and i'm going to be sharing a haul from all over the place i have alta i have kohl's i have tj maxx marshall's um i have a few other things here and there so yes if you like hauls if you want to see what's in stores right now stay tuned because i'm going to show you everything that i found so let's get started the first things that i'm going to share with you guys are from alta so i let's start with what's on my face um i did film a video on this look right now and this is all of the stuff from the um, Revolution and Simpsons collection. So I have here the Treehouse of Horrors primer base. Um, it's okay. It's not that great. It's called the Alien Slime Primer. It smells very earthy, kind of like grass, um, but it does nothing to your face. It does feel really nice. I bet if I put it like in my little skincare fridge, um, it would actually feel very refreshing. So other than feeling nice, it doesn't really do anything for your face um so that's the first thing that i picked up i also got the eyeliner if you guys want to know what i think about this collection go and watch that video um if it's not up by now it should be up soon um so yeah i am trying to do this whole week i'm trying to upload a different video every day whether it's a haul or a makeup look because i do have several um collections that have, that have to do with halloween so i definitely want to try and upload a video at least once every day so <laughs> let's get going so again i found i got the primer i also got the eyeliner and this is the one that has the glitter in it. i got the um devil flanders lip combo which is what i have on my lips right now it's the red one um, I got the face palette. This is called the Spectacular Face Palette. Um, I got one of the little eyeshadow palettes. This one's called Alien Maggie. And then I also picked up the, um, the brush set. And this one is called the Bolier Coven <laughs> um, Brush Kit. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. Um, but yeah, I picked up those. Um, and then I also got a few things from the Gilmer, Gilmore Girls and Ulta collection. So I got this little box here. It comes with a few things. I can't keep the things to stay in <laughs> their little things. But this is called the Girls Night in Ulta Beauty X Gilmore Girls. This comes with one under eye cooling balm, one pair of cooling eye pads, one facial mist, one lip scrub, and one tinted lip oil, and one universal balm. So it comes with all of that here in this cute little box. Um, I also picked up a candle from that collection, and this is the Coffee Please and a shot of Criticism. I think that's what it says or uh, I can't really read what that says something sism criticism or something like that um my daughter and I we love this show because we feel like <laughs> like it's us in a show like my daughter I have a 15 year old daughter and it's that show is just so close to our relationship so we both love that show very much so I definitely wanted to grab a few things from that I didn't want I didn't want to grab the um makeup and stuff because I heard that it wasn't that great and it can be a little pricey so I just went with the safe stuff which is the um the candle and then the little eye things because I do enjoy that type of thing also got one of their Christmas uh, tree hut scrubs this is the candy cane and it's the small one when I ordered it I thought it was the big one but it's actually the small one but that's okay because I have a lot of scrubs so um it it, it works out so got that and then I picked up um the hangover pillow balm kit which comes with four different hangover balms so it comes with the original 
comes with the candy cane, the watermelon kiss, and the frost yourself. Um, and I have the original in my purse right now, and I love it. It's so nice and so hydrating, moisturizing on the lips. I love it. I think that it's such a good set, um, and I can't wait to try the other um, flavors or the other scents or whatever you want to call them um, but yeah I do enjoy the original I decided to give the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette a go um, I haven't really heard anybody talking about it but I found that the that the shades were really nice so I kind of wanted to give it a go it kind of reminds me of the Laura Lee Los Angeles palettes um, cause they're like in the nude family, but all of these are matte and then these are some kind of shimmer. So can't wait to give this a try and see, um, what the quality is like. I didn't know that, um, Jaclyn Hill was going to still, you know, partner with Morphe since she has her own line, but, but yeah, it should be nice to give that a go and see how it is. I uh, found a few things that are new from Makeup Revolution. So I saw that they have a eyeshadow base and I love uh, using eyeshadow bases before I do my my eyeshadows because I do feel like they do help um, make your eyeshadow last and make it pop. So I'm going to give this one a go. It's a pretty big size and I think it was only like $8, 8 or $12, somewhere around there. So I'm going to give that a go. Oh, very exciting and then they also had this which is called a brow block glue so it's for your brows um, sometimes I really don't want to do anything to my brows um, especially for like work or whatever so I just kind of want to tame the hairs so I'm gonna give this a go and see how it works it looks pretty promising also saw this from LA Girls and I think it's new. It's called the Lip Plumper Mood Gloss and it comes like that. And I'm gonna give it a go and see. I'm always very curious with like lip plumpers, so can't wait to try that. Saw this um, from Essence and it's new. I hadn't seen it before. It's the Glimmer Glow Lipstick. And it doesn't come in the shade, I don't think. There was only one, which was this one, and it's exactly what it says it is. It's just a glitter um, lipstick, but I want to see if it's like a lip balm or does it have some kind of tint or something. So this is what the lipstick looks like. It's clear, but it has glitter in there. Okay, so it's like a balm. It's like a lip balm, but it has glitter in it. So it's right there it's clear can't really see it doesn't have a color although it's kind of turning a little bit pink so I don't know if it's like one of those um, lipsticks that kind of turn a different color with your pH but it's turning kind of pinkish and then you can definitely see the glitter so that's gonna be nice just like a little something something on the lips especially for like the holidays that are coming up found a few things on sale that I've been wanting to try. So I found this uh, Yes to Watermelon Light Hydration Facial Cleanser for $4.49. I've been dying to try this brand, um, especially because it's watermelon and you guys know that I'm obsessed with watermelon. <laughs> also found the moisturizer from the same brand. This one was $6.49. And then I also found this um, Makeup Revolution X Rachel Leary, I think it is, lip gloss. And this one was $3.49. I saw it and I kind of wanted to try it. I saw somebody talking about it on YouTube and she was really impressed by it. So I'm going to give that a go and see what I think. Yeah, it's definitely turning pink. So that's going to be like a nice like lip balm with like a little bit of shimmer. And then I picked up my birthday gift for this year and the gift was the Clinique Moisture Surge Hydrator. So that's what they gave me as a birthday gift this year. Um, and then I picked up two more things from Ulta but those are I ordered online. 
and I'm going to be making videos on it. So I picked up the Essence Advent Calendar. Um, so I'm going to be making a video um, after Halloween is over and we're going to see what's inside. Actually, if you turn the box, you can kind of see <laughs> what's there, um, which I wish they didn't do that because it's like an Advent Calendar, you know, it's like a mystery box. Like, don't include what's in it. I want to be surprised. So we are going to be unboxing this little baby in a video after Halloween. And then the last thing that I picked up at Ulta is this massive box. <laughs> so I picked up the Wet n Wild and um, Little Twin Stars collection. So this little box comes with everything in the collection. I'm so impressed by this collection. I haven't tried it on my face yet, but I am so impressed by everything. The packaging, just everything. It's just so cute. This box is... <laughs> humongous like I got home from work the other day and um I saw an Ulta box and I'm kidding you not it was like almost my size and I'm like what the heck is in that box I don't remember ordering anything that big from Ulta but it was this um and I used all of the points that I had to get the whole collection because I mean really it's not that expensive it's like 74 dollars um but I used a coupon and it brought it down to like 50 dollars and then I used all of my points um, to buy this baby so stay tuned I'm going to be filming a video with that um, coming up soon okay let's move on to a few things so let's see let's move on to Bath and Body Works so I picked up a few things from Bath and Body Works um, they were having a sale on their aromatherapy line, and I'm obsessed with that line. I find it so relaxing um, and so soothing. So I picked up a couple of things for sleep. I got this body wash in lavender and vanilla. And I also picked up the lotion in chamomile and bergamot, and it's also for sleep pick those up can we to give them a try got some festive things for the uh, Thanksgiving season so I got a body spray in marshmallow pumpkin latte and also the body lotion in the same scent scent in the same scent <laughs> and it smells so good it smells like candy I definitely smell like a hint of pumpkin, but nothing too crazy, but it smells like candy. I got a free hand lotion with a little coupon I had, so I got the pumpkin apple scent. And I got three body soaps, which I didn't know that um, Bath & Body Works made body soaps. I got champagne toast, which is such a nice scent. I got cucumber melon which I love anything cucumber and melon. And then I picked up my all time favorite scent from Bath & Body Works, Black Cherry Merlot. This smells so good. This is usually like my fall um, scent, the Black Cherry Merlot. I just love it so much. Update on that lipstick, it turned very pink. <laughs> Looks very nice. Can't wait to try it on my lips. So that is everything that I picked up from Bath & Body Works. I know you guys like when I do um, videos on Bath & Body Works because we all like to know what's new in store, right? Let's move on to Kohl's. So I went to Kohl's the other day and I got a few items here. Let's start with some um, festive earrings for the Halloween season. So I picked up these earrings from, I think the brand is called Napier, Napier, something like that. But it's this cute little set of three different earrings. It comes with a witch hat, comes with um, candy corn, and then some cute little pumpkins that says uh, trick or treat. And these were originally $20, but I think I paid like $8. Um, they were on sale and then I had a coupon, so I brought it down to like $8. Um, and then picked up these cute little potion bottles 
from the Kohl's brand. These were $12, but of course, you can always use coupons and stuff at Kohl's and bring the prices down. And then I got two of the Lauren Conrad earrings. And I got some um, little cats right here, of course, because I'm a total cat lady. And then I got some little ghost as well they are super cute original price twelve dollars each but of course with coupons and stuff you bring it down oh i forgot to show you guys one thing from ulta that i also picked up so i picked up a nail polish and this is from their christmas collection it's from sally hansen and it's called under the tree and it's green but it also ships color to like a purple a blue a red yeah it's like a sh one of those shifting shades i love those so, so much but yeah i forgot to show you guys that i also picked that up okay continuing with kohl's i got a few clothing items so i picked up this cute poncho i love ponchos they are uh, they're just so beautiful to me um, and then I saw that they had this brand, which I've never seen before at Kohl's, and I'm always at Kohl's. Um, it's called Yummy uh, Sweater Company. And so I got this poncho. At first, I was like, should I? Should I not? Should I? Should I not? But what got me is that it has a hole in the sleeve so that you can put your arms through. Because the ponchos that I have right now don't have that. So it's kind of uncomfortable, you know, that you have to kind of get your hands out of the bottom of the poncho to kind of do anything but this has a hole so i was like okay you're coming home with me and i tried it on and it's the cutest thing ever i love this so much um the original price was 60 dollars, but it was on sale for 40 dollars. and then today they had a sale of like 35 percent off um they had a coupon and so i paid 24 dollars for it <laughs> That's how you have to shop ladies with coupons and sales and things like that because yeah that's the way to do it so pick that up so excited to wear that i got a plain black shirt they were on sale for nine dollars but of course with the coupon it came down to like six dollars it's just plain black long sleeve i got a couple more earrings here or i got one more earring and then something really cute um these are like christmas stuff now you guys i know i talked about halloween now we're gonna move on to christmas so i got these super cute earrings and they're like a mug of like hot chocolate and you can see like the little marshmallows and then the little candy canes and it's just so cute i love it i love wearing like festive earrings that's my thing. I always have to go hunting for festive earrings. They're so cute. And then I also got something from that same brand. I think it's called Napier or something like that. But so during the Christmas season, I am obsessed with gingerbread people. I am just obsessed with them. And they had this cute little pin. Oh my god, isn't that adorable? It's like the girl and the boy and gingerbread cookies. And I got this because like, I got can pin it on a jacket or even on like my poncho right here. And they're just so freaking cute. I hate to admit it, but I think I'm going to be one of those older ladies that <laughs> has like all of the festive like um, vests and pins and just like festive all around. Cause I just, I love that so much. I don't know why I just do. But yeah, I couldn't pass it up. It was super cute. And like I said, I'm obsessed with gingerbread people as I'm going to show you right now. I told you guys I'm obsessed with gingerbread people. So they have these cute little bowls um, and they have gingerbread cookies on the side and they're red and they're just so cute. And they're like the perfect size, very cute and perfect for like, um, uh, for like cereal and things like that for like the coming um, Christmas so got those and I got the salt and pepper that goes with it <laughs> it's just so cute I just love them so much I think they're so stinking adorable and the last thing that I picked up at Kohl's was an ornament so this is from Hallmark keepsake and it's called the sweet decade ornament and it says 2021 and it has a cute little snowman in it 
let me take it out of the box so you guys can see it but my daughter and i we have this thing um that we get a uh, an ornament like a yearly ornament and we started this tradition since my son passed away so every year we get an ornament with the date with the year not the date but with the year um and we started that since my son passed away kind of to remember him in a way you know and then we also always get uh a an ornament like my daughter picks an ornament and i pick an ornament for the tree um but then we always have to have the yearly ornament and i thought that this one was just so precious and so cute and it, it kind of looks like candy like gummies it's kind of how it looks but it's so pretty so yeah that is our thing we do this every year let's move on to hot topic so I've done a Hot Topic video in the past. I love Hot Topic. I think that's one of my favorite stores when it comes to buying anything for like Sailor Moon or like Disney related. Um, so I had to go to the mall the other day for, I can't remember for what it was. I think it was to like use some rewards in Victoria's Secret or something. And um they had a bunch of hocus pocus things at hot topic and of course i'm obsessed with hocus pocus so i picked up this cute little socks and it says i put a spell on you and it says hocus pocus disney on the back and it has the three sisters right here. um and i also got a cute little notebook and it says broom squad <laughs> And it has like different tabs here. You can see Banks is right there. Then we have the witch's um, pot. Um, then we have like a potion and the eye. And it's just really, really cute. I also got a pen from Hocus Pocus. And you can see like Banks. He comes <laughs> up and down <laughs> right there. And then the most exciting thing that I found was um, this year when the Spirit of Halloween stores came out, um, I saw that they had like these little figurines from Hocus Pocus and I bought so many of them. Um, and then I realized there was a version one <laughs> because the ones that I had gotten this year were version two. And so I was like, oh man, I missed out on those. But surprise, surprise. Um, Hot Topic had the version one. So I got three of these little babies here. So this is what they look like. And they come in these little bags and they also come inside these little cardboards. Um, so it's like a complete mystery. You don't know what you're going to get. But I actually, like I said, I bought three. So I got, I got Mary. And she's so stinking cute. I love it. I love her so much. Okay, I have Mary. I got Sarah. I got Sarah right here. And she's holding her lucky string. <laughs> That's Sarah. And then I also got, I think her name was Allison. I got Allison and her little dress that her parents had that Halloween party in the movie so I got those three and then let me show you the ones that I got from Spirit of Halloween so from Spirit I got a Sarah but this is a different version she's holding her broom instead of her lucky string so this is version two version one I got Mary and she is so stinking cute. She's holding her little vacuum cleaner. Of course, she is completely different than version one. I got Winnie. <laughs> She's so cute. Her hair is just too much. I got um, the little girl. What's her name? Oh my gosh, I forgot her name. Well, I forgot her name, but I got her. And she has the little witch lollipop right there. It's so cute. I really want a version one of her because she's holding Binks. And it's just so stinking adorable. I got the dad in his Dracula costume. And I also got Binks. <laughs> so cute. And then a friend of mine at work gifted me 
um, I think his name was Jay, one of the kit punks. He's so cute. Um, and then I was so sad because I couldn't find any more. I really wanted to get Billy, but I couldn't find him. Um, I couldn't find any more. Like after I went back, after I bought all of these and I went back to get more, they were all sold out. Yeah, like I guess it's very popular. Let's move on to an order that I placed with Makeup Revolution um, themselves, like the website. So like I said, I got the Makeup Revolution and um, Corpse Bride mirror. So here's Emily and Victor. Super cute. I love this mirror. It's so cute. And it's such a good size too. Like I was able to do my makeup only with that mirror. So very cute. And this is the packaging that it comes in. Super adorable. And then I got a bunch of friend stuff. So they released a whole new collection of friend stuff. So if you don't know, Makeup Revolution has been doing uh, a collab with Friends, the TV show, for quite a while now. I have a video where I did, uh, where I reviewed their first Friends palette. It's a big one. Very, very good palette. If you want to watch that video, it's up on my channel. Um, and then they released some other ones as well. I do have them. I just didn't get to make a video on them, but maybe I will. But I do have two of those palettes. And then they released this third collection. So I got a few masks. So I got three of the face masks. We have the Ross uh, mask, which is the anti-blemish tea tree sheet mask. I got the Rachel which is a hydrating hyaluronic sheet mask. And it looks like this. And I got the Monica, which is the pore refining niacinum. I don't know how to say that, you guys, but it's the pore refining sheet mask. And it's the mirror. Can't wait to use those. I got this uh, pumpkin spice lip care set, which comes with a lip scrub and a lip mask. So let's look and see what it looks like. It's so cute. It has like pumpkins and pumpkin pies all around. This is going to be fun for like November. So we have the lip mask and we have the lip scrub. Mmm, it smells really good. It smells, it smells more like vanilla. Vanilla caramel than pumpkin. Yeah, this one's really good. Can't wait to give the base a go. Super cute little duo. Um, and then I got one of the mirrors. I really loved this mirror with the teacup. I just loved it, or the coffee cup, sorry, the coffee mug. I also have this mug as well, so super cute mirror i haven't taken it out of here but it looks like a really big big mirror so very excited about that and lastly i picked up the espresso buddy butter and i'm not gonna lie i picked this up because it's coffee uh, scented so i'm obsessed with coffee you guys okay got that so let me show you now what i got at marshall's so at Marshalls, I got some home stuff, some home decor and stuff like that. I picked up these wooden um, boards. <laughs> wow, brain fart. Okay, so I picked up these wooden boards. Um, they came like wrapped in this little ribbons right here. These were $4.99 each. I picked these up because I had like a little um, girls get together at my house the other day. And so I used these for uh, a cheese board and also for like a sweets board. So I put like crackers and cookies and things like that. And then I put cheese and um, fruit and vegetables in the other one. So that's what I got these for. And like I said, they were $4.99. I am not going to use those for like cutting anything. I'm going to strictly use them as bad as like cheese boards. So yeah, that's that. I found these cute um, ponytails with the little um, bows right here and these were $5.99. They come in like these cute little colors, very fall colors. 
Um, we have these like yellow one, like mustard one. We have this tan one, light pink, and then we have a black one. Can't wait to use those. Got some um, makeup removing wipes. Of course, very festive with the Halloween. So we have here uh, pumpkin spice, candy apple, vanilla sugar, and vitamin C. I am very curious about the candy apple because I'm obsessed with that. So can't wait to smell those. And then I got this body scrub. This is the foaming body scrub from the brand Onyx Bathhouse. And it's in the birthday cake with chia butter <coughs> scent. So my birthday is on Friday. And again, I kind of wanted to be festive. So I got this um, birthday cake body scrub to use for this week because it's my birthday week. And we're gonna go back to Christmas. <laughs> I got some um, Christmas socks from the Ray, uh, Ray Dunn um, brand. And this is a 10 pack of ankle socks. And it comes with all different um, sayings on them. So some say, la 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 la, silent night, deck the halls, oh holy night, oi to the world, or joy to the world. Uh, deck the halls or jingle jingle bells jingle bells Santa baby baby is cold outside uh, run run Rudolph and let it snow so I think they're like songs I'm yeah. thinking yeah they are songs. yeah they are songs well I've never heard of that run run Rudolph no it is a song <laughs> it's a song, it's a song. Oh, I've never heard of it, but yeah, so I got this 10 pack. I am ready for Christmas, you guys. I am ready for Christmas. Found these cute Halloween earrings. Um, I don't know what the brand is still. Let me see. So the brand is Bella and Jack, and they come in these cute little boxes right here. Super adorable. And so I got these uh, cute cat earrings. They are so so stinking cute they are a little big though but i don't care they're super cute and those were 12.99 and then these are one of my favorites these are so cute they're also cats they're black cats and they're so cute these were also 12.99 and the good thing about these is that yeah they're halloween themed but you can use them all year round because there's really nothing about them that scream halloween so i'm gonna use them all year round I've got a shirt so i found this cute little shirt right here and this was on sale for 12 dollars original price 16.99 and it's from the brand uh grand and grease super cute very soft can't wait to use this again we are celebrating my birthday so i got this birthday cake um home scent thing <laughs> i love having these around i have one here in my room i have some downstairs um some in the bathrooms i love these for like small spaces because you can really smell them so got this one a birthday scent or birthday cake scent and it was on sale for four dollars celebrating my birthday y'all got some beauty items this is just gonna be so long got some beauty items i got a face mask so i love the face masks from i do care and this is the space kitten it's the black one with all of that glitter and i just i love their face masks they are so good so gentle on the skin and yeah i'm gonna have fun with this one my daughter also loves face masks so i tend to keep a lot of face masks around but yeah that's how it looks it's black and it has a lot of glitter in there can't wait to use it smells really good it smells like perfume so i'm sure she's going to enjoy it Close this one. Oh, I killed myself by accident again. Found a few lip stuff. 
So we have here the Stila Beauty Boss Lip Gloss and Transparency. So this one is just their clear gloss. I love to have clear glosses on hand and the packaging on this gloss, beautiful. And this one was $5.99. Uh, got one of the Boxum Plumping Lip Polishes and this one is in Aphrodite. Aphrodite. Well, Emily says it's Aphrodite, but it says Aphrodite, but no, I don't know. It's pronounced Aphrodite. But <laughs> this is the shade right here. It's like a like a very light pink, but it has like a really tiny shimmer in there. So that's the shade right there. Very pretty. It smells like vanilla. Of course. <laughs> And that was $6.99. Found a couple NARS lip things here. The first one is a lipstick, and this one is in Bad Reputation. Not gonna lie, it reminded me of the Taylor Swift album, Bad Reputation. And it's like, it's one of her signature colors. It's red, just like she always does. She always wears red. So reminded me of her and I don't own any NARS lipsticks so I'm gonna give this one a try especially because you know Christmas is coming and I love wearing red lipstick during the holidays and this one was only $7.99 and I have another NARS um, lip gloss here this is the oil infused lip tint and this one is in the shade Orgasm X. So I recently purchased the Orgasm X um, blush from Ulta. So it was cool that I found the matching lip oil, which is that one right there. Very pretty. It's like an orangey, kind of like a peachy orangey um, shade. Very pretty. Love the packaging. And this one was $7.99. Got a couple more um, body scrubs. So this is the Keep It Fabulous <laughs> lip scrub. And this one is, oh, not lip scrub, body scrub. And this is in Scary Berry. And this one, my daughter picked it up and it was $5.99. And I got the Witch Please, which is the Wicked Apple. And I got that one for me, and this one was $5.99 as well. And the last item I picked up was this Pure Lee's um, Watermelon Energizing Aqua Balm. And this one was $6.99. Okay, so let's move on to what I found at TJ Maxx. It never ends. It never ends. So let's see, I found a few things at TJ Maxx. I found a e.l.f. lip balm and this one is in the shade Cheeky Cherry and I got it for $2.99. Love the shade of it, especially for the holidays. Got the Beauty Blender um, sponge cleaner and this one was $4.99. I got the um, I Heart Revolution and Disney Cinderella eyeshadow palette here. It also has a face palette in there and I'm probably going to give this one to my mom because she really liked it so I think I'm going to give it to her. Found this I Heart Revolution Tasty Watermelon Highlighter. I saw it at Ulta the other day and I wanted to get it but I was like no. I'm just gonna leave it and then I found it at Marshall's <clears throat> or at TJ Maxx. I found it at TJ Maxx for $3.99 so can't wait to give that a try. And then I got this from Rude Cosmetics. I've never tried anything from Rude, Rude Cosmetics but it's called the Nude York Times Square Face and Eye Palette and it comes with a face and a eyeshadow palette so I'm gonna give that a try and see how it is. I've never tried anything from Root Cosmetics. Found this super adorable jar. Um, I'm probably going to use it as a cookie jar. I actually put some cookies in here earlier. Um, and it's so cute for like the Thanksgiving season. And this one was only $7.99. Love the color and then the little pumpkin on the side and the pumpkin head. 
Love it. I picked up a candle. This is the Sand and Fog Muled Wine Soy Wax Candle. It smells super delicious. Love the lid. And this was on sale for $6. Mm, it smells so good. Kind of smells like a fireplace. Picked up a uh, perfume. This is from the Gwen Stefani collection of pop electric music and I got it in the purple one it's already over there in my background so you guys can see got some hair ties I love these with like the little bows super cute those were $3.99 got a couple of nail polishes from the OPI collection this one is in I can never hutch I can never hut up. It's like a cute, like, light blue with a little bit of purple in there. And then I got this one for the Thanksgiving season. And this one is called Yank My Doodle, which is like a beautiful orange. And I've worn this one already, and it's so pretty. Got some shirts for the gym picked up this cute little green one for like Zumba and it was on sale for $8 and got this cute little sweater for the gym as well love the purple color and it was on sale for $12 my daughter wanted to pick up one of these cute little candles these look like coffee cups this is in the Himalayan sea salt latte and this one was $7.99, very pretty. My daughter also got a eyeshadow palette from Beauty Concepts, I believe. Yeah, Beauty Concepts, this is the Hot Noodles. She loves these noodles, so when she saw this palette, she wanted it. And it was on sale for $5.99. Got some Marc Jacobs uh, nail polishes. I'm obsessed with nail polish, as you guys can see. I got this cute little pink and this like gray shade in here. It's like a two pack. And this was on sale for, or this was $6.99. It wasn't on sale, it was $6.99. Going back to Christmas, <laughs> I couldn't pass out this cute little cuffy mug here and this is $7.99 at TJ Maxx this is for the Christmas season it has cats all over of course because I am a total cat lady my daughter and I we are going to take the lacy route and we are going to use these um, chocolate bombs <laughs> instead of making our own we just bought it already made and these were $7.99 can't wait to give these a try and they have the chocolate and the marshmallows in there so can't wait to give those a go picked up um this dish from the ray dunn collection it was 6.99 and it says joy in it for the christmas season i have um some uh, soaps that I bought at the Grand Floridian um, Disney Hotel and I like to display them because they're so beautiful so I bought this to put downstairs in the guest bathroom and then I picked up the Coca-Cola 1971 Morphe collection so I was on the fence with this palette I was like should I get it should I not but it's so pretty <laughs> And then my daughter doesn't help either. She told me to get it. So, But the colors are so pretty. So can't wait to try this palette and see. Almost done, you guys. Almost done. I got these cute little cupcake um, cups here. Uh, baking cups. They were $3.99. And I used these for like that little girl's night that I had at my house the other day. Got some pants. Super cute black pants. They look like they're going to be like super comfortable. And they have like elastic at the bottom. And these were on 
this these were $14.99 picked up some coffee this was $4.99 this is the fall in love this is really really good it kind of tastes like vanilla. I had one of these little coffee flavor trios. I have it already in my coffee um, bar. I'll show it here. These were $6.99 and they came with pumpkin spice flavor, pumpkin caramel, and pumpkin. Last thing is from Home Goods. And I picked up, we're going to continue my obsession with. Gingerbread cookies. <laughs> Aren't they so cute? And this cookie jar was $7.99. So, yep, that is everything that I picked up. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I just kind of wanted to show you something from like all over the place. I, I didn't feel like I had enough to just do like one video for like TJ and one for like all the other stuff so i just kind of combined it all into one i hope you guys don't mind i hope you guys enjoy it i love watching hauls i hope you do too um i showed you some you know things from halloween and also some upcoming things that i've been finding for christmas so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already don't forget to leave me a comment let me know your thoughts i love to you know have conversation with you guys there and I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye.